Hi Virgo friends, welcome to Tarot Readings by Roxby. I hope you guys are all doing well, staying safe and healthy. This is going to be your two-week reading, April 13th to the 26th for Virgo Sun, Moon, and Rising Signs. And as always, Virgo, if the reading doesn't resonate for you, please watch your other signs. Shadowscapes, gorgeous deck. Virgo, Spirit, Sun, Moon, Rising Signs, April 13th, 26th, Virgo. Virgo, April 13th, 26th, Virgo, those of you that would like to get a private reading, follow me on Facebook, Instagram. Links to everything you guys need are right below the video in the description box. Justice. Queen of Swords. Knight of Swords. Queen of Wands, Six of Wands, Four of Pentacles, Seven of Swords, Two of Wands. The overall energy. Wow, nice. The Chariot. It's your overall energy for the next two weeks. So it's at the bottom of the deck. Eight of Cups. Interesting. Some of you definitely could be walking away from something or someone. You know, but really look at this card. It really is all about diving deep. A deeper meaning. On an emotional level. I just feel like some of you are really diving down deep and finding out or understanding like your feelings and your overall energy is the chariot. So I really feel like some of you are figuring out exactly what it is you want. I feel like it's something that you have been dreaming. Like something you're dreaming about. And taking control. For some of you, I feel like you're realizing something. You have justice, sign of Libra. And you also have the queen of swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. So some of you definitely, you could have Libra in your chart or you're dealing with one. For some of you, this could be a legal matter. And you would have a female attorney. You know, but traditionally the Queen of Swords is, she's very analytical, you know, she's all about the truth, nothing but the truth. Sitting next to justice, this is all about fairness. Those of you that do have a legal matter, I see a lot of victory, success, whether it's you or the person that you're dealing with. Like someone wants justice, fairness, with the Six of Wands, Honestly, I, I really feel like... I mean, you have both victory and success cards here, Virgo. And with the Six of Wands, I feel like this is the public. Like, public justice, public victory. 
but a whole lot of success being recognized publicly. You and maybe an air sign woman are literally in the spotlight the first week. Whatever injustice has been done, justice is being served. Things are definitely being made fair, right. Four of Pentacles is about control, but it's also, you know, wanting to feel more stable, more secure, you know, saving your money, not spending as much. For those of you that do work in the public, getting publicly recognized, there definitely could be some kind of big, big promotion that, that's coming in for you the first week. And this is going to give you the opportunity to save money. But again, there is definitely some kind of unfairness here because you do have the Seven of Swords. The Knight of Swords. With justice, this definitely could be a work situation. A boss or a co-worker could have treated you like shit in some way. The Seven of Swords, most likely, they were you know sneaky, shady, a liar. You know, some of you, something could have happened where you were skipped over for a raise or promotion, something like that. But now you do have this fairness that's coming in it's like i see you publicly winning and then interestingly enough you have the queen of wands so some of you could be dealing with a fire sign woman but there is some kind of unfair situation but now things are definitely starting to move forward you know the chariot virgo as your overall energy is you making a decision. This is you taking control. Four of Pentacles chariot taking control of the situation. You know, I really feel like taking control and I feel like changing a direction in which something was moving and now you you see justice and fairness recognition something even happening publicly if someone was being sneaky shady there's haps, that's absolutely coming coming to you you know with the chariot and the knight of swords things are could be happening very very quickly suddenly there could be news important information coming in and for some of you, it is definitely very suddenly. You know, the two of wands could be you if you're a business owner. Something with your business or business partner. You probably think they're very shady. You know, this person could have been lying. You know, to you trying to get away with shit. That would definitely be coming out into the light. So if someone was trying to cheat you... That's coming out into the open, Virgo. And also with the Eight of Cups, I, I just feel like you're having a deeper understanding, a deeper meaning. Knowing why something happened. <laughs> Interestingly enough, while the King of Swords is under this, you have a lot of air around you guys. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Then you have this Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. So for some of you, this could be a relationship or your partner. But then you do have another Queen here. So if you're a Virgo man, you definitely could be dealing with two women. You know, oh my gosh, the Empress. Oh my God, the King of Wands. And then Strength. Leo. 
King of Wands, Leo, Aries, Taurus with the Empress. Oh my goodness. So the King of Wands and you have the Queen of Wands. Some of you absolutely could have a situation involving five people regarding this matter. Others of you, this could be another woman that's important for some of you. There could have been some cheating. Strength is there. So it could be with a Leo. But again, this this Eight of Cups is, is gaining a deeper emotional meaning. Some of you definitely could be walking away from someone. The Chariot is the ultimate victory and success card. So I do see you winning. Two of Wands, you know, you're planning, looking to the future. You could be making a big decision. But for some of you, this definitely could be something that is in the public, like very much in the public. Virgo, very, very interesting. Some of you are definitely dealing with five people in this situation. God help you. Magical Times Empowerment Cards. Let's get you some additional guidance here, Virgo. These are only red in the upright, Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, Spirit, April 13th to the 26th. Healing. Bless all in need of healing, hope, and love. Spirit grant us strength and wisdom. Guide us to the path of wellness. Healing. That's coming in for you again. You are dealing with some kind of injustice. It's a public matter. You know, you could work in the public eye. There is something that has not been fair and it is possible that you've been on this journey, Virgo, to find the truth for a while. But I do see you very, very passionate and determined. This card and justice is a lot of healing and moving forward. You know, Virgo, this is a very, very interesting reading. But very, very positive. Very positive. But the public seems to be very, very important. Something coming out into the public. Very interesting. But amazing. Virgo, absolutely love you guys. If you are not subscribed to my channel, please be sure to subscribe. I would very much appreciate that. And I will see you guys back here soon. Take care, Virgo.